so I'm trying to adjust. Oops. Okay. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a baby clothing haul, pregnancy update, and a little bit of a story time. So, um, a lot has happened this past year. I am literally seven months pregnant. Um, as some of you probably know from my Instagram, uh, posts and everything, so, um, yeah, uh, I don't normally do vlogs that much because I'm always busy with something, uh, now I am babysitting full time instead of, like, actually having a job and stuff, I mean, this babysitting job is good, I get paid really well. So that's really nice. But anyways, um, this baby clothing haul is not to show off or anything. I will be reviewing, you know, the clothes and, you know, and, and this is just to show that you can get really cute baby stuff for really cheap. So, um, I got these clothes at once upon a time. They were having a, uh, a pink bag sale, whatever, you fill up the bag with as many, uh, like, onesies, uh, as you can. Sorry, I'm running out of breath. And it literally costed $10, except we got two bags, so it was like $20. And actually, all the clothes that we got would have costed over $70, so it really, like, amazed me. And I was really happy with what we got, so. A lot of my friends voted on doing the baby clothing haul. So, here it is. It's not to show off or anything, so please don't think of it that way. And if this isn't something you really come for on my channel, you can just watch another video. So, yeah. Cool. Um, I My mom also got me... Uh, three baby afghans that are baby afghan blankets that I'm going to show you guys. Um, I don't think I even mentioned this, but I am having a boy. Um, his name is Jonas, and, uh, it's after the song My Name is Jonas by Weezer. So, it's really cool that he's named after a song, because I'm named after a song. So, I was really happy with that idea that my fiance gave so and I'm sorry if I say uh a lot this is not like scripted or anything so it's just off the top of my head um while I go through the clothes and everything I'm just gonna be giving y'all a pregnancy update and all that jazz uh, this is not gonna become like my channel is not gonna become uh, like, I'm not gonna upload, upload a lot of, like, baby videos or anything. It's not gonna turn into that. It's still gonna be mainly covers and all that. But if you guys are wanting updates and stuff, uh, I, I'll post it if y'all want. And, uh, you know, when the baby's born, he might be in some of the videos. I don't know. We'll see. We'll just wait and see how that goes so yeah so first i'm gonna show these uh baby blankets that she got from salvation army because they have a color of the week um sale thing like they'll have certain sales where uh like for this one it was tan colored tags uh whatever you get with a tan colored tag, it's half off. So, um, yeah. But this is a plain blue, light sky blue baby blanket. It's really cute and soft, and it smells good because my mom just washed these blankets yesterday. So, um, yeah. And this one I like the most out of all of them. Because, um, there are these Fox stickers on Facebook, 
and uh, Facebook Messenger, and me and my boyfriend use them all the time, so we really thought it was cute that she got this, and, like, it has a little fox on it with a little teepee uh, tent thing, and it's just blue and white stripes and super soft for baby. And then the last one is a plain white afghan. So I really like the blue and white theme going on it. It's really cute. Definitely, um, you know, fits the theme really. So that's nice. So I'm going to set these back here. So you can get some really good stuff at Salvation Army. Even though most of the stuff is, like, donated, it's, you know, it's available and cheap and, yeah. So, I'm going to try to go really, like, I'm going to try to go quick with these. Because we ended up, like, getting over 60 bodysuits. Um, they're really cute. I'm so happy with them. Uh... So, yeah, I'm just going to show you guys. I'm going to try to, like, do it in, like, groups and stuff. But they're really simple bodysuits. They're, some are soft, and, you know, this one has a K-Wings, I think. It's the K-Wings or something. It's a team here or something like that. I, I don't know. I think it's K-Wings. Um... Yeah, I don't know. But it's cute. I like it. Um, the usual, the little Superman suit that you always got to get them. Spider, or Superman is awesome, just like my dad. It's cute. And of course, this says, I love dirt. We literally just grabbed and go, like, grabbed stuff and went. And this, I got this because it has the Mickey, and I love Disney stuff. I actually have another uh, onesie in here that's Tigger-themed, but I'll, we'll eventually get to that one. I think, yeah, these are three to six month clothes. They had really good deals. Um, well, they had really good onesies out, so, um, yeah. I think I have another one that says the same thing, but it says Daddy's number one draft pick, which is cute. I'm hoping to get more clothes for him soon. I thought this was funny. Birth nailed it. You probably, I don't know if it's going to mirror it when I post the video, but it says Birth nailed it. This is a Notre Dame shirt. Or, not shirt, onesie. I don't know what I'm talking about. Um, and I thought this was funny and cute. Um, my mom. I wish, like, they had stuff that said Yaya instead of Grandma, because that's what, uh, our baby is gonna call my mom, is Yaya. But it's Don't Make Me Call Grandma. Either way, she's still, you know, Grandma to him, so... It still counts. But a lot of these were really cute. And I just love them. I tried to get as many, like, different colors as I could. And, of course, different sizes. I mainly, um, tried to avoid getting too many newborn stuff. Because, you know, they grow fast. But, let's see. This says, over the moon for mommy. Yeah. This, I thought that was really cute. A plain striped green onesie. Oh, this is the Tigger one that I was talking about. It's really cute. I love it. I love the Disney stuff. Like I said. A lot of these are pretty soft and comfy 
for baby, but this is just has a little whale on it, and it's blue. Um, this is a plain, like, strike one. Um, just different blue, orange, gray, striped. <laughs> this one I had to grab. It says, be busy being brilliant like mommy. Cute. I'm probably not going to show all of them, but most of them I will. But, there's that. Cool. And, uh, I had to get this one too, because it's Batman. It says, Mommy's Future he Hero. Um, I'm just going to go try to do this real quick. And I'm sorry if I repeat myself a lot. I just, I normally do that. So, this one just has, this is, a. Uh, uh, it looks like it'd be like a newborn onesie. It says size small, so it's really cute and tiny and adorable. It's got little sports balls, footballs, soccer balls, all that fun stuff. Oh, these are so tiny. This is green stripe one. Oh, this is cute. Oh. I grabbed this one. It just has little trucks and cars. You know, things that boys normally like. Single and ready to mingle. I thought that was cute, so I had to grab that. And this is a plain strike one. It's kind of like a newborn size. This is zero to three months. I think this is mixed with zero to three months and newborn, but uh, it has a cute little bear on it. And this is a space theme. We're thinking that we might do a kind of space theme for his nursery, but I'm not sure yet. I'm not sure how that's going to work. Um, whether it be nursery or Disney themed, it's going to be something. Um, Joe, she likes to go after my mom's dog's food. Hey, Joe, get, yeah, you, get out of her food. You have your own food right there. Freaking nut. Uh, mommy's little man, and it's got a little mustache. Yeah, that's zero to three months. Uh, oh, it says rad like my dad. Because his dad is red, so I thought that would be cute to get him. And this has little stars. Um, oh! Oh, no. Um. Oh, uh, now we get to the long, some of the long sleeves. Okay. This is a big pile. Oh, here's some short sleeves first. Plain striped, uh, brown and gray. Uh, this says my dad is great and has a little um, crocodile on it. Uh, I got. I wanted to get a couple, um, some bright colored ones. So here's like this tannish yellow-ish long sleeve onesie. It's 12 months. Most of the... Try to get some small sizes with long sleeves, but most of them came in the, like, bigger sizes. So, um, no, this one's three to six months. This is a just plain yellow one. I thought it'd be cute. And let's hear it for Dan. That's what it says on this. And it's just green. Here's a plain gray one. <laughs> this one says Daddy's Main Man. Because, you know, the line Main and Main. I thought that was cute. Um, just black and gray, well, black stripes and, you know, gray. Some of these are really nice and cute. Um, 
this is just another little sporty one, football themed. Um, it says touchdown. This video is super long already. Uh, no one understands how hard it is to be this handsome. And it's long sleeve. These are the long sleeves ones, so. Uh, my auntie is out of your league. This one has a penguin on it. Um, this one says, I'm limited edition. And I think these two are plain stripe ones. Which I really like the stripes. Uh, it's cute and simple and nice. And this is a newborn uh, size. Uh, well, it's zero to three months. Um, so he'll be able to wear it for a while. And it's sporty themed. What is that? It's like a little lion. I don't know. But it has a little animal on it. Oh, this is the other one that says Daddy's number one draft pick. Uh, and then I got a few more left, and that'll be it. Um, so yeah. Let me put these back in here. Oh, and one pregnancy update. I did my glue close um, test or whatever, the one hour test that you have to do when you're about 24, no, 26 weeks to 28 weeks. I did mine at 27 weeks in a few days. Um, which was like last week, and um, it actually was not that bad. It uh, the drink that I had to have that I had to take was the orange one, and it was fine after a little bit. But then it got really tardy, like after a few minutes of drinking it. So then it was just really gross towards the end, and it only upset in my stomach a little. But they let me have water afterwards. And that was really nice, and, um, basically, I got my results two days later, and my glucose is elevated, and my iron was really low, so now I am taking iron pills to elevate my iron, and then this week, some point, I have to go in for a three-hour test. So, that's gonna be a pain, because I heard you get, like, a shot every hour that you're there and I hate shots I really do but like who doesn't this has little monkeys on it these are the three to six months rookie of the year that's what this one says this is a plain lightning bolt uh, onesie this one says, way behind, way, and way behind, way beyond cute. And it's just a plain blue one. And then this says, uh, mommy's little stud muffin. If this gets boring for y'all, you can just, like, fast forward it. I probably should have mentioned that before, because eventually I am going to have a little story time. Um, so yeah, uh, take me to grandma's and let the spoiling begin because, I Joe, hey, she got in the food again. Y'all don't understand how much I yell at this cat. It's like I already have a child and she is like my child, so, but that's the one that I just read. Plain blue striped one, because I like the stripes. This was cute, because it has, like, little bears on it, or whatever. Another plain striped one. I thought this was cute. The prince has arrived. 
mom is hung so this is a plain red stripe one I didn't have too many bright colored stuff like I wanted to try to get so these have little animals on them this one, I pra like, there's two that are practically the same, and it's this one, but this one has, like, it, it's a smaller size or something like that. Or no, this one is, well, they're both 12 months. I don't know why we grabbed two that were, like, basically the same. Well, I guess it's not really the same. It just has the same theme as the sports. And then the last two... I really wanted to grab because they were like colored in blue and these are 12 months and these have little dogs on them and this is little big guy so these are all the little bodysuits that I was able to grab we literally got one bag um, with 30 of them in it and then the other one was 33 and that's the one that I filled up. And so uh, we literally got 63 outfits all together for $20. A lot of these are cute. And a lot of these, if they weren't like part of the sale, they would have been like $1.50 or like close to that. Most of these are $1.50. And that's pretty like a pretty good deal for onesies and stuff so I thought that was really nice and like I said I had to go to the sale because I if my sister hadn't tagged me in the post I wouldn't have known about it but yeah um so basically that's that that's all the clothes that I have for now well I have more clothes but um these were more new, and like I said, I wanted to review them, and uh, a lot of them have really cute sayings on them, really cute themes. Joe! No! I'm really sorry for having to yell at her so much. She does a lot of stupid stuff, but, um, but she's a cat, so, yeah. Anyways, um... They're really cute. Some of them are really soft and like it feels good to touch and all that. And it'll just be really nice for him to wear. Um, I tried to, cause you know most of the baby's times they're gonna be wearing onesies and stuff, so that's gonna really you know be their thing. <sighs> But anyways, my story time, uh, is, I have the stomach flu right now, and I don't think I've had the stomach flu before, but it really sucks. It started yesterday at 4 a.m. I felt really sick both ways, um, and it's the worst I've felt since my first trimester, my first trimester, uh, I was throwing up a lot, like, from week 8 to week 12, and now it's really rare for me to get sick, but yesterday was the first time that I was getting sick over and over and over, and I was like, what if something's really wrong with me, and what if it affects the baby? So, I went to the hospital yesterday. First hospital trip since this pregnancy besides ultrasounds and stuff and they I was really dehydrated so they put an IV in me and I hate needles like I've said I don't like shots or anything like that I don't like getting blood work done I hate it I just I can't stand it I don't like the feeling it makes me really nervous luckily my fiance was there with me to keep me calm um, but anyways, I had to have an IV, and I had to have fluids put in me, because I was really dehydrated, and it felt so weird, 
at first because I've never had that like happen before uh, with the IV and fluids and you can literally feel the fluids at first going in you and uh, it was just it was a weird sensation but after a while you don't feel it and you just have to be careful about moving your arms so much because of the needle in you and um, they took my blood and my pee and they had to do tests and we were there for like three hours maybe four like we were there from 9 30 to 1 and like I was up at 4 a.m. and uh, my fiance Tim didn't wake up till like 6 a.m. and that's when it was like really getting bad um, like I could not control anything and it was awful and so after all the testing and stuff they had uh, they said it was viral gastrin they used a really fancy medical term for the stomach flu so I have the stomach flu right now and it's kind of, um, it kind of died down a bit. Like, I'm feeling way better than I did yesterday, which is good. Um, so I guess you can get the stomach flu when you're pregnant. Um, so, you know, watch out for that. Um, people who are pregnant now or thinking about getting pregnant. Because, like... Your hormones are changing, and, like, it's, you have a baby growing inside you, and it's just, like, it's crazy. It's, I never thought that I'd get the stomach flu like this. I've had, like, the pneumonia, and, yeah, I've had the pneumonia, and I've gotten sick and stuff, and I've had the runs and all that before in my lifetime I've never had the stomach flu and I felt so awful yesterday I slept a lot I drank a lot of water I'm drinking a lot of water today and making sure my hands are washed and everything I finally took a shower today because I was just so gross yesterday I felt so gross that I did not want to do anything so, you know, when you're pregnant, just be aware of your surroundings and be careful because I don't even know who got me sick or what got me sick, but I guess uh, the stomach flu is caused by um, getting it from an in infected person or eating something or drinking something that was contaminated. By whoever was infected by it so and I really think it was something that I must have ate that got contaminated or whatever um, I literally I didn't think it was the stomach flu I literally thought it was food poisoning or something because I had McDonald's the night before I had gotten really sick yesterday so yeah that was fun not really. That was sarcasm. But y'all probably caught on to that. I know. But anyways, that's the baby clothing haul and the few extra things that I got. Um, we, I might, I don't know if I'm going to, but maybe I'll film a little bit of the baby shower. It's going to be later this June. Um, but for the most part, um... I'm going to be going back to covers because I don't really vlog a lot. I want to vlog and I have ideas and stuff, but like it takes a lot to actually get me to sit down and film them. And I don't have the best camera right now because my camera is actually cracked on my phone and I film from my phone. I eventually want to get a really nice camera that I can vlog and record my cover videos on. So, 
hopefully that can happen in the future. I just don't know when that will be. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoy this vlog, pregnancy update, story time, and everything. Um, when you're pregnant, once again, I'm just going to say this, be aware of your surroundings and all that so that this doesn't happen to you in the future because I literally don't know how I got sick. So, yeah. And it's really important not to get sick when you're pregnant, but you can't always avoid it. So, uh, yeah. That's that. The baby is good. He's kicking. He's moving around. So, uh, so far everything's good. I just gotta do that three-hour test this week. And hopefully that turns out fine and that I don't have gestational diabetes because I really don't want to have to deal with that. I already have to deal with my iron being low. And, yeah. So, anyways, once again... Hope y'all enjoyed this video, and stay tuned for the next video, which will probably be a cover. I don't know what cover yet, but, um, just stay tuned. Um, I'm working on a few different ideas for covers. So, yeah. I'm done talking. Um, until next time, uh, before I go, uh, Follow my social media links down below. Follow my Facebook page, um, my Instagram, and my Snapchat. I don't get on Snapchat a lot, but um, I do post sometimes on Snapchat. Mainly post on Instagram and my Facebook page. Not so. Those links are all going to be down below in the description box, so go follow it. And yeah. Until next time, stay tuned. Bye. Hey guys, future me. Um, future me here uh, while I'm editing. Uh, when I recorded this vlog, it kind of like cut off at the end, which is why I look confused and stuff when I'm saying those links will be posted down below, blah, blah, blah. Um, it cut me off and uh, I didn't realize that when it did. So, um, anyways, I also wanted to show y'all this quilt, other quilt that I recently got, that I got actually after I made that video, and it's really cute. I didn't know what it was at first, um, cause there were like different colored ones and everything, and these ones had eyes on them, and I was like, what is this, and all that, so... When I was allowed to go grab a quilt, Joe quit. She was trying to scratch out the quilt. But this is what it is. It is a Cars themed quilt. And it's really cute and I'm really happy that I grabbed it because like I said, I love Disney. And Cars is a really good movie and all that so I'm really happy I grabbed it. Um, I also realized I could have done the haul, like, way, like, better. Like, I could have done it in groups and just showed you guys all the different ones that there was. <coughs> but I didn't. And, you know, I don't really feel like redoing the haul and all that. So, um, y'all just gotta deal with what I put. And I also realized... That the first onesie that I showed you guys was not the K-Wings logo. I am no good with team logos. So if you guys know what that is, uh, what that logo was, feel free to um, correct me down below. But anyways, if you guys haven't, uh, please subscribe and stay tuned for the next cover. My next cover is going to be Exhale by Sabrina Carpenter. I'm really excited to cover that because it's a really pretty song and it's easy to play. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and you know, stay tuned and subscribe. Bye y'all.